Hello, it is the 21st of December and today I'm drawing a picture of uh, It's a Thargoid Cave. This map room is just the best thing ever. They're really fun. They're fun to operate and to set up. They're a bit of a faff to get all of the various bits you need to create the swirling galaxy that you can make appear in the central chamber. But once you've got it going, it, it just looks lovely. It really does. And it gently rotates, like kind of like the galaxy. They've got these weird central structure, like almost some sort of insect legs coming down over the centre of the room where there's these receptacles where you can place the different elements, the Thargoid link, the probe and the sensor. And if you put one of each of these in, that uh, activates the structure. People recently have been uh, experimenting with putting guardian relics into the receptacles in the map chamber and that has quite a different effect <laughs> the, the Thargoid scavengers and, and the map room itself goes all really red and angry and, and explodey but these these relics if you set it off with the relics in now since the great reversal of the Proteus wave event which had the Thargoids taking control of the big bomb that was supposed to destroy them all when you put a relic into the map room now and activate it, the Guardian Relic is converted into a, a sort of a corrupted relic. It, it goes all kind of Thargoidy green. And additionally, if you're the one that's collecting these uh, these corrupted relics from the centre of the map room, you need to make sure that you're not... Uh, in, the, in the centre, there's this pillar of fire that suddenly appears, uh, does all sorts of bad things to your uh, SRV, your little buggy. It is thrown into the air and twists round depending on how hot and how close to the center of the the pillar you got you'll you'll spin round you can spin round several times if you got really hot in there it is quite impressive anyway uh, see see you tomorrow bye